What's up guys, me Tommy I'm here bringing you another video. Today is going to be a bit different because I I fell asleep yesterday when I wanted to record my video and uh, yeah I didn't have the time so I'm basically recording this for, before going to work. Uh, I wanted to do a small video talking about Red Dead Redemption trailer and uh, Nintendo Switch. That's what I wanted to do yesterday but fortunately you won't get all the, the super edits or stuff like that so uh, so this is the first time I'm recording from my phone, so hopefully it's not too bad. As you can hear, there's cars and it's raining a bit outside. But it's not too bad. My camera records pretty good on my new phone, so we shouldn't have a problem here. So yeah, let's start with the Red Dead Redemption trailer. So I, I was waiting patiently uh, for it since uh, Tuesday, which was pretty fun. I enjoyed it. The graphically, graphically looked amazing. Oh, the light's kind of weird. Uh, the graphically looked pretty amazing. Uh, it didn't reveal a lot on the trailer like you, you guys saw. It's a minute-long trailer. Uh, it didn't show much about the game or anything like that, but it was pretty interesting to watch. It gra graphically looks amazing. It did show uh, a lot of the set the tone of it, um, stuff like that, the, how nature interacts with each other. You saw a predator there killing a small little uh, rabbit there or something like that. That looked pretty awesome. Uh, how uh, uh, one of the horse, where one of the cowboys there has a horse beside him and he's, uh, the horse has a deer on the back of him. That was pretty cool. Uh, so, sort of a fight between a, uh, what seemed like a fucking turkey <laughs> and a wolf or a dog or stuff like that. So that was pretty fun. Then we got we got a little voice tease of uh, what the story might be about. Uh, didn't reveal that much, but it was still pretty interesting to listen to. Uh, what else to talk about? Um, so we know it's coming out in fall 2017. Uh, I'm quite excited. Uh, I, I saw on their Twitter they, they said it was a partnership with uh, Fa uh, not Facebook. Uh, PlayStation and the whole video was recorded on the PlayStation 4 so that's pretty fun um, sorry you're, you'll see it since I'm not editing a lot you're gonna see there's a lot of um and stuff like that because I'm trying to gather my thought at the same time uh, yeah so I really enjoyed the, the Red Dead Redemption 2 trailer no I don't have any problems with the name a lot of people are complaining like is it they're trying to figure out if it's a continuation of the of the other game and stuff like that. it might be might not be uh, some were speculating this might be like the, um, the uh, like, uh, like the prequel to Red Dead Redemption, where uh, John Marston and his gang there. And but we're not sure. No, nobody's sure, so we'll we'll leave it at that. Uh, definitely go check it out. If I would have been at home and editing it, I would have probably showed you a small snippet of it. But oh well. So the NX. Now the NX trailer, this is something that surprised me. I only knew about it the same day actually, because I, for some reason, I didn't follow. I was, I didn't see that news the day before, and uh, oh boy, does it look interesting! It actually got me interesting in a, in a Nintendo console a lot. Uh, the fact that the controllers sna snap on and off, and that's very interesting thing to look at. Um, the fact that it's a portable console, uh, that each controls are, God damn it, sorry, that each each controller is actually yes. Uh, you can play for two players but those controllers look a bit small uh, but we'll see there is a pro controller seems to be like it uh, so yeah um, what else um, they, they show a small snippet of uh, the next Mario game maybe the people a lot of people on the internet are not sure but I'll, I'll take I'll take it for granted that that's probably what it is but who knows um, hopefully the, it has a good price range because that's the one that would that, that makes me uh, uh, consider if to buy it or not. I would go like, I would say two ninety nine American. It would be okay, but I, I live in Canada, so it's probably gonna be like three ninety nine. Um, yeah, so just gotta switch hands there for two seconds there. There we go. So yeah, so uh, what else to talk about this game? Um, so it did show some Skyrim. Uh, they haven't confirmed if it's actually a uh, Skyrim remaster or just some like stuff they piled in together to try to make it look good or stuff like that. I'm not 100% sure. I didn't get a chance to look deeper in that. But the fact that um, it has that big controller thing where you can slide the two controllers into, like, sort of um, transformer type thing. Uh, it looked it looked pretty cool. Um, yeah, sorry for all the um. I'm really sorry. Uh, but it, it, all in all, the, it looks interesting. Um, definitely, it, it makes me think about buying it because just for, for Zelda alone, honestly, I would probably think about it. Um, and the potential of transporting and like when I go out of town or stuff like that would be very interesting to, to see and, and work around with. But that is it. Thank you so much, guys. That's that's all I can say right now. I got to go to work. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. If you enjoyed the video, like the video, subscribe to the channel. 
Follow, um, follow me everywhere, Me Time Gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, and right here, youtube.com forward slash Me Time Gamer, where I post a new video every day of the week, Monday to Friday, 10 a.m. Eastern Time. So thank you so much for watching the video, and I will see you in the next one. Keep on keeping on.